Gisolo, district woman member of parliament position campaigns, is facing challenges due to the steep terrain, with vehicles unable to access some locations. At one point, Minister for Information Chris Baliomisi and team went on foot together with NRM flag bearer Rose Kavajeni. The team visited Bukembiri constituency where NRM supporters waited along the roadside. One of the things that we have found in Chisoro are the divisions amongst uh, our people based on religious uh, sentiments. So that is very unfortunate. So we, we hope that the people have listened to our voices and we hope they have also appreciated and listened to the voice of the flag bearer whom they voted during the primary election. The Minister for Information, Dr. Chris Baliomosi, asked the people of Gisoro to put political differences aside and vote for the NRM flag bearer, Rose. <laughs> The director NRM mobilization, Rosemary Seninde, urged Gisoro residents to avoid all internal conflicts and rumors on the president's visit to Gisoro. On the, four, on the 12th, which is Tuesday, we expect our president, who is also the chairman of NRM, to come and uh, campaign with us to also solicit for votes for our NRM candidate. And we are very hopeful that when he comes, he will also probably change the mindset. Local leaders in the district asserted that Gisoro is known as an NRM stronghold and that electing someone else could be difficult to explain to the president. UPC candidate Hingabire Mebo also toured various parts of the district alongside UPC president Jimmy Akena calling on Gisoro residents to vote for Mebo as she promised to bring development and address the issue of poor roads. You see this by-election has created an issue in that um the primaries in NRM, there's been a, a, clearly some signs of rigging and it's something which did not go down well with someone like a, a Philip Mateka and maybe many of the members of NRM. And in my case, I, our doors are always open for everybody who feels um, that they can maybe be recognized more or do better in a different uh, setting. We are always going to be open and welcome them on board. President Yori Museven is expected to visit Gisoro on Tuesday 12th November next week.